the importance of Adik Mas. Now, this year particularly is very, very special because Chatur Mas conducts of four months, but according to the Hindu calendar, there is one extra month which has accumulated, which we will learn how it accumulated, which is called Adik Mas, also known as Purushottam Mas. Purushottam Mas, this month is of God. This is God's month. That's why it even overrides Shravan Mas, and that's why it's even higher in fruitfulness of performing devotion in that particular date, in that particular month, which we'll learn in the near future. Number one, Purushottam Mas. The name Purushottam translates to the Supreme Being, Purush meaning man, and Uttam, the greatest. Therefore, Sri Hari himself has benediction over this month. Bhagwan Swaminarayan's month, we can say, is called Purushottam Mas, meaning yeah, for each and every month, there's a history, there's a certain reason behind it. But this particular month, which only comes up every couple of years, is very, very important because it's Bhagwan Swaminarayan's month. In the Gita, Lord Krishna says, Among all months, I am myself the Purushottam month. Observing the Purushottam Vrat is quite powerful. It is capable of washing away sins, bringing peace, harmony, good fortune, and ultimate salvation. Number two, the Hindu calendar. Now, the Hindu calendar is particularly a little complex, but to break it down, we'll be able to understand. As the Hindu calendar is based on the lunar cycle, a difference between 10 to 11 days occurs between the lunar cycle and solar years. When when this accumulated difference when this accumulated difference exceeds 29 days every 3 years an adjustment is made with an extra month the adik or you can say extra or purushottam mas that's why we can read again that there's a difference from 11 to 10 days occur occurs between the lunar and solar years when this accumulates, the difference exceeds 29 days, which is a month, every three years, an adjustment is made with an extra month, which is called Adikmas or Purushottam Mas. Number three, the history. All months are dedicated to a specific Dev. And when Adikmas first arrived, the Devas were wondering, who, is, who to dedicate it to? And what was it decided that it would be dedicated to Lord? It was decided that it would be dedicated to Lord Purushottam or Bhagwan. Thus, it is named Purushottam Maino. And God blessed the day by saying that whoever does bhajan bhakti during this month will please me immensely, and I will I will burn their sins, and they will attain eternal bliss. Now, after knowing such kind of maima or importance. You're now probably wondering with intense desire, when is it coming up? What exact date is it? I want to perform my niyams on the most highest day possible. So that number one, Bhagwan counts it as the most. And number two, all my sins will be burned away and I will attain eternal bliss. Well, you'll find out in the near future. Importance. This month is regarded as very auspicious and great punya is attached to it so it is very important that we do not waste this opportunity to serve to serve supreme godhead bhagwan swami narayan lord krishna lord purushottam narayan or whichever god is close to you to the best of your ability you will attain 1000 times more punya for your good deeds in this month 1000 times more think about it if we could just sit at home and make a lot of money without doing anything wouldn't we do it all of us yeah we would definitely this month of purushottam mas or adik mas which is coming up is that particular month to gain the most happiness the 
to gain the most rajipo, to gain the most merit from Bhagwan Himself. How much much? How much so? One thousand times more. That's why it's very important to take niyams in this particular month. Number five, what do we have to do? Well, obviously, in Chaturmas and in Shravan Mas, we found out in the same way, fastings, prayer, reciting Janmangal Srotra, reading the Vachnamrut Dandvats, Mahara, focusing the mind and spirit on God are just some of the niyams that are mentioned here, but you can take anything you would like. Maharaj has himself said that by carrying out the vrats or vows in this manner produce, produces unfailing results and one overcomes the greatest of misfortunes. This month also dissolves misfortunes and gives bliss at heart. And finally, don't miss the chance. Don't miss the opportunity that comes only once every three years, take one small niyam and do it for the whole month, just one month. And finally, the time that you are waiting for the date, the announcement, September 18th, 2020 to October 16th, 2020. This is the month of Adikmas. You can write it down. You can mark it on your calendars. If you have Loya Dampadivar calendars, you can just look at it. It's there. September 18th, 2020 to October 16th, 2020. This is the particular month of Adikmas where Bhagwan Swaminarayan, it's his own month and Maharaj becomes 1,000 more ple uh, pleased by taking niyams. Saying this, my humble Jai Swaminarayan.